Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today is an exciting day because I decided I would start my first ever challenge in The Sims 4. Our objective for this challenge is to give birth to a hundred freaking children <laughs> in as few generations as possible. The challenge ends as soon as the 100th child is born or if you fail the challenge for breaking rules. When I was reading the rules, I thought, wow, <laughs> okay, this will be hard. And I feel like I'm setting myself up for many, many, many stressful and exhausting hours of playing The Sims based on other simmers that I saw try this challenge. So yeah, if you want to see me suffer for the next few months, welcome. You're at the right place. First things first, we should probably look at the rules. Base rules. You must play with aging on and set to a normal lifespan. Any mods or CC that give you an unfair advantage are not allowed. No cheats. The only exceptions to this are BB.move objects on for creative building purposes and cheating to resolve glitches. If a lot your matriarch moves into has existing lost traits, you may not edit them or add to them. All in-game rewards may be used except ones that prolong your sim's lifespan or save them from death. Newborns cannot be aged up until you get a notification saying that it is their birthday. Infants can be aged up once they have tried all the different baby foods. How will I keep track of that? Oh lord. And that's not all because infants must age up with either the happy infant or top-notch infant traits. So make sure you have been extremely attentive to them before you age them up. Toddlers can be aged up when they reach level 3 in all toddler skills. Children and teenagers can be aged up when they get an A in school. Young adults can be moved out of the house to make room for more children, but they cannot be moved back in. When your matriarch becomes an elder and can no longer bear children, her youngest daughter takes over as the next matriarch. You cannot make more room in the house faster by killing off underage sims or letting babies, toddlers or children be taken by social services. Noted. Your matriarch may be self-employed or have a work-from-home career but cannot have any job that requires her to go to a rabbit hole destination. She cannot have a part-time job. Teenagers may hold part-time jobs to help support the family and bring in extra income. Your matriarch may leave her home lot freely. She does not have to bring all her children with her whenever she leaves the lot. Your matriarch may not get married while she is of childbearing age. Your matriarch may not get pregnant by the same donor twice. Donors may not contribute to the household in any way. They may not move in, help look after the children or provide any financial aid to the household. Your matriarch is responsible for supporting all her children by herself. Your matriarch may not influence the gender of her children, avoid strawberries, carrots, pop music and alternative music to avoid influencing the gender of unborn babies. Use the in-game randomizer to select all the children's traits as they age. You may hire maids, gardeners and repair technicians, but you may not hire a nanny. Take care of your own children! Noted. Okay. Then there are of course some add-on rules as well, but I'm not going to read them out loud because I don't want to bore you to death. So you can just read through them, pause the video if you want to. Okay, so this is our matriarch. This is the brave woman that will give birth to a hundred babies. I hope you like her. I love her. I don't know. I just love green eyes. And I think she's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Her name is Sadie. And for her last name, I chose Hundredson because I just feel like it's perfect. <laughs> it's perfect for this challenge. So when it comes to her outfits, this is her everyday wear. I kept it simple with this one. Uh, then formal. I absolutely love this outfit. She looks amazing. And look at her. Hello? Hello? She looks so good. I love this outfit on her. And I don't think that anyone will be able to resist her charm in this. Moving on to athletic. I feel like Sadie is the girl that actually enjoys working out. And so I will try to make her work out at home or at the gym as much as possible. I don't know how possible that is, honestly, with a bunch of kids, <laughs> but we will see. So this is the first one. I love it. I love her hair and I don't know, she's just so pretty. This is the second one. 
I also love this one. Then the third one, something more summery for when it's hot outside. Number four is another simple one. I just wanted to change it up so we don't see her in the same outfit every time. And then this fifth outfit I created for running mainly. So yeah, when she goes running, I just feel like this is the perfect outfit. Moving on to sleep. I kept it simple when it comes to her pajamas, so I chose these shorts and this top. And for her hair, I wanted to keep it a bit messy, like, you know, she's going to be a mom. And then she also has a second outfit, and it's just this plain t-shirt. Moving on to party. This is her party outfit. I thought I created more, but seems like I only created this one. I think she turned out even better than I thought she would. I don't know, I just really like her vibe. Let me know what you think in the comments. Like, do you like her? Do you like our matriarch? But back to the outfits, I really like this dress on her and I like the tie-up thing in the back. Moving on to swimwear. This is her swimwear. I only created one outfit. This is her hot weather outfit. Um, I gave her a hat and some sandals. Again, kept it simple. I think she looks amazing. And I also created a second outfit. And it's this one. And then for cold weather, I again kept it simple. And then I also created this one for maybe fall or spring. I just realized I forgot to show you the rest of her everyday outfits. I don't know how I forgot to do that, but here we go. This is her second outfit. I really like this one. And the third one is more comfy. When she starts having babies and will have to take care of them, I think she will want to wear something more comfy. So I just created this one. For her aspiration, I chose Big Happy Family. So this sim wants to build a large, loving household. Perfect for her. That's exactly what she will do. And then she's also a bookworm. Goofball, creative, self-assured, and family-oriented. Now that you got to know our matriarch, let's move on to the house. Okay, so Sadie just moved in. Welcome to her house. But before I show you the house, I wanted to say I'm playing in a save file by Charlie Pancakes. So if you like how it looks and you want to have it in your game as well, I will link it down below. And yeah, that being said, let's check out the house. This house was one of the few beginner houses, so I had to add a few things because it was pretty much empty. <laughs> so yeah, I created this tiny living room area and then the dining area. And for the kitchen, again, kept it simple. And don't worry, I didn't upgrade anything, she will be struggling. Everything is basically the same as it was when I bought the house. It has the same fridge, stove, toilet, everything. So yeah, I just basically added things that she actually needs and I tried to make the house less empty, you could say, but it's still pretty empty. So this is her bedroom. As you can see, I only added a bed and some lamps. And now that that's out of the way, we can actually start the challenge. So... She still has 620 simoleons, that's amazing, that's more than I thought we would have. So the first thing I think I'm going to do is to buy an easel because we need it to make money. I think this is pretty good for now. Now that she's feeling fine, her needs are pretty okay, I feel like we could go to the gym. I'm sure we will meet some people there and we need to find our first baby daddy, so... Sadie has just arrived to the gym, and let's check this place out. Who is here? Okay, I see a potential. Oh, he's a gym trainer. Let's go introduce ourselves to him. Let's ask him about hobbies and skills. We need to talk him up. We need a baby. I also wanted her to work out with him, but... Goof around. Come on, Sadie. Do your thing. Sadie has learned the following traits about Jose, he's a goofball, okay? Let's tell him a joke, come on, Sadie. Oh my gosh, he doesn't like us, he actually doesn't like us. Okay, whatever, there are plenty of fish in the sea, plenty of potential dads in this gym. 
girl, it's not the time for a workout, come on. I wanted you to work out, but now we have other things to do. Come back right here. Hello. Now you can be jealous, look at them. Trying to show off now that we left. Too late, Jose, too late. Now we have Jaden. Jaden Armstrong. Um, let's talk about the sunny weather. Move, Jose, why are you so angry? You had your chance. We might come back later to you, but not now, so yeah. Jaden seems to like us. Oh, why is she <laughs> standing like that? Um, ask about taste in music. Oh my gosh, it actually annoys me that she's standing like that. <laughs> Why is this girl joining us, Miss Miss Anita? Could you leave us alone, please? Jaden likes romance music. Good to know, sir. Can you leave, please, lady? I'm trying to do my thing here. Let's share ideas with him. Oh my gosh, why are so many people joining us? Don Lotario is here. Welcome. You might be the next baby daddy, sir. Just so you know. So, talk to us. It's good to have you in our contacts. I just realized she's not even wearing her workout outfit, even though I created like five. So, let's change it real quick. We asked him to hang out with us and he said, okay, I can hang out for a bit. So let's hang out with him. Where is he going? No, you're not going to cook. Oh my gosh, she's tired. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, girl. I want her to work out too, though. I don't just want her to be here because of the daddies. Where is he going? Is he leaving? Is he actually leaving? I just asked you to hang out, dude. Wow. Okay. That's unfortunate, but... Our girl is unfazed. So let's just work out for a bit and then we will go home and... Oh my gosh, it's almost 3 a.m. That's unfortunate. I just realized I only have 270 simoleons, so she will need to do some painting because we will be broke really soon. Okay, so now she's done with her workout. Let's just go home. Okay, Sadie just got home. By the way, look at this save file. I tried a few, like I downloaded a few and I tried playing in some, but I just feel like this is my favorite one. I love the wipe. And where is she going? Oh, she's going to sleep. Is it that bad? Are you that tired? It's the next day and it's almost noon. Outside, there's a thunderstorm. Just, you know, the perfect day to get pregnant. Um, She's hungry, so let's cook something. We need to get better at cooking because we will be cooking a lot. Hello. Um, can you cook? Okay. She's cooking. She caught herself. Amazing. <laughs> she really needs to get better at cooking because it will be a struggle. When she's done cooking, I will ask... Was his name Jaden? I think it was Jaden. <laughs> I will ask Jaden to hang out with us and hopefully he will give us a baby. Because we need one. We don't have much time. We won't be young forever. What happened between us and Anita? Okay, let's just uh, invite. Um, hello, Mrs. Crumplebottom. We don't really want to talk to you right now. We're waiting for Jaden. You could start painting until he comes. Because we really need money to pay our bills. Because I'm scared already. And we don't even have kids yet. So, yep. Where is Jaden? He should have been here by now. Where is he? Oh, he's coming from the... <laughs> He's coming from the back. I got scared for a second. Isn't this door set to front door? It is. So why did he come from the back? Okay, whatever. The most important thing is that he's here. Okay, stop painting now. 
it's pretty good for her first try, to be honest. Did she make some money? Oh, it's not done yet. My bad. Hello, Jaden. I'm happy you found time to meet me. He looks bored. He looks like he's done with us. Where are you going? No, you're not going to wash your hands. You're going to sit down and talk to this man right here. Let's talk about dreams. Um, Complain about weather. Propose crazy scheme. Come on. Why is he still bored? How can you be bored when you're talking to me? Hello? <laughs> is it too soon to start with flirting? I hope not, but I'm scared it is. Oh no, I'm so scared. Oh no! I knew it. I shouldn't have done that so early. No, what are you doing? Hide from everyone? You just got rejected. Get used to it. I'm sure that will happen many times because you will be flirting with many men. <laughs> it's okay, he still likes us, so... <gasps> Jaden! Are you kidding me? Is this actually happening? Why is it more difficult than I thought it would be? I thought this challenge would be easier. And I can't even get the first baby daddy to have a kid with us. Hello? Oh my gosh, why so mad? Um, where are you going? Don't... It's okay, you just got rejected. But now he's laughing and smiling again. So, so come back. I need you to flirt with this man. And maybe we should just be honest, you know? Maybe we should just be like, you know, Jaden, we actually only need a baby from you. So don't worry about us. We will only... Oh my gosh, are, are you serious? Why is he like that? What city has learned that Jaden is a stay-at-home dad? Does he have a wife? Is that why he wasn't happy when I started flirting? Wait, no, I need to know. Do you have a wife? Do you have a girlfriend slash wife slash something? Quickly ask him if he's single. Come on, are you single? Sadie has learned that Jaden is married. Oh. Okay, I'm sorry, sir. Um... <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry, because I'm pretty sure that sooner or later we will need to start getting together with people that are not single. Because I doubt there will be so many single people, but oh my gosh, look at this guy! Hello? Hello, sir. Hello, Alfred. How are you today? You just showed up at my place, pretty much, so... Are you trying to hint at something? Because I'm in. Okay, stop talking to him for now. And come. Oh no, where is he going? Where is... No, Alfred. Wait, where is he going? Oh, look at this guy. Look at this man. This is what I like. He's not scared. He's confident. We want a confident kid. Friendly introduction. Oh, he's cleaning up for us. Thanks, Jaden. Oh, he likes us. Look at that. I already feel better around him. Let's be friendly. Let's ask about his hobbies and skills. Sadie loves a confident man. Okay, Sadie, stop. Oh my gosh. No, you're okay. Jaden is already gone. And he probably already forgot what you did. Like, you didn't know he wasn't single. Discuss interests. Ask about his career, and I don't know, gossip about family drama. Like, you know, I want to have a hundred kids. I know it sounds ridiculous, but... Yep, that's me. <laughs> and, oh, I missed it. Is he a fisherman? Oh yeah, he's a fisherman. That makes sense why he... Sadie, I swear, don't hide from everyone. This guy is actually interested in you. So come down here and talk to him. Ask about relationship goals. Let's get more personal. Sadie, come back down here. I swear. 
This is Romeo and Juliet, look at her. It's not a balcony. <laughs> but let's pretend it is. We don't like each other enough for me to answer that. Okay. Trying to stay mysterious, sir? I'm okay with that, for now. Alfred is a goofball as well. This is a perfect match. Aw, Sadie's sentiment about Alfred closer from happy memories. <gasps> Sadie Hundredson thinks Alfred is unattractive. That doesn't matter. Sadie. Oh my god. Come back here and talk to this man. Let's goof around. He's actually so nice. I hope he doesn't have a wife or something. Look at her smiling and laughing with him. It wasn't the same with Jaden. They are made for each other. Or more like made for having a baby together because you can't be together after that. But <laughs> yeah. Oh, we can hug him. Should I risk it? Life is too short and it's already day two and we still are not pregnant, so I just have to risk it. <laughs> Go in for a hug, Sadie, come on. Don't be scared. No, you're not going to hide from everyone. Why didn't they hug? Did he say no or something? I told her to hug him. Let's ask him if he's single. But if he's not single, I will go for it anyway. What is Jaden doing in- What are you doing here? What? <laughs> Was he inside the whole time? Alfred is single. Hell yeah. What are you doing here? He low-key wants us. But yeah, I don't know. Jaden, you're confusing me. You're giving me mixed signals and you have a wife, okay? I'm going to focus on Alfred. So, yep, you can go. You can leave now. I just wanted to say goodbye. So thank you for doing that yourself. Bye. <laughs> I need you to have a baby with me, sir. Ask him. <gasps> he hugged us. He hugged us! Oh my gosh, Alfred, you're amazing. Thank you for the hug. You made my day, actually. And could you make a baby as well with me, please? No. Where are you going? You like the color brown? No, 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 don't leave. Don't leave, Alfred. Don't leave us. Please. I know it's late, but you can't leave us now, okay? We need you. We need you. Let's ask to hang out. Come on, Sadie, run. Run for your life. This is your future baby dad, come on! Hey Alfred, do you want to hang out? Please? Did he say yes? Did she ask him already? Go ahead Sadie, I'm waiting. Come on, say yes. Is she asking him? What is she doing? Why are you chatting? Did he say yes? I don't think he said yes. No, he didn't say yes. What is happening? Okay, let's try to make a flirtatious joke. I'm so scared. Please like us. Please have a baby with us. Come on, Alfred. I need a baby. I'm getting old. Where are you going? He's running away from us. No. Sir, please, you don't understand. Please stay. Why are you running away? I asked you to hang out. Why can't I ask you again? You know what? Whatever. Let's just go inside and eat because, oh, he's coming inside. Okay, I thought he was leaving. Why are these men so hard to get? Like, why are they playing? Why are you eating our salad? You didn't even give us a kid yet and you're already eating our salad. Oh, you better impregnate us tonight. Let's confess attraction. I think it's time. I know you like us, Alfred. I saw the hearts. Okay, there's an option to flirt and I feel like it could work because he's playful. Please, please, please like us, please. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Where are you going, sir? You're not going home. You are not. You ate our salad. You're staying here with me. He likes it. 
Come on. Okay, I can hang out for a bit. Where are you going? If you can hang out for a bit. No. He literally said, I can hang out for a bit. And then he was like, I'm out. And he's running away as well. Why are all these men running away from us? We just want the baby from them. It's not like we want to marry them. <laughs> She's tired and she also needs a shower. But I feel like she can finish painting this and get better at her skill because we need that so come on it's almost done anyway so we made nine simoleons that's a good start okay so sell it and go take a shower and then you will sleep her sleep schedule is so messed up it's 5 a.m and she hasn't even slept yet <laughs> She was at the gym at 2 a.m. Girl. Okay, so now that you're up, let's be like a champion, okay? And then, are you hungry? Your hunger is still okay, so I feel like we should call Alfred to hang out with us. And then you will go and paint. Alfred will be right over. That's amazing. This day is going good so far. Oh, Alfred is already here. Welcome. Okay, let's get this going. Because we need to get pregnant today. I refuse to wait another day. Oh, he's melting. That's right. Look at him, he's smitten. Finally. Because there's an option to have our first kiss. Okay, go for it, girl. I trust you. Come on. First kiss. Yay! Oh my gosh, we can woohoo. We can finally woohoo with him. We are doing it. Come on. I can't believe it's finally happening, guys. After so much work. There you go. Break out the candles. Make it romantic. Say it is about to woohoo for the first time. Yup. Hopefully she also gets pregnant for the first time. <laughs> come on, come on, please. Okay, it's taking you way too long. I'm way too excited. So come on. I need to know if you're pregnant. No protection was used. Amazing. Now, please just be pregnant. Oh my gosh, please be pregnant. Please, please. <gasps> Sadie is pregnant, there's going to be a new addition to the household. Thank you. Thank you, you go girl. Good job. Okay, thanks Alfred. I think we can move on now. It's over pretty much. So before you eat any more of our salad, I'm going to ask you to leave. That's right, you should really get going. Now we can focus on Sadie and her needs. She's hungry and she's already grabbing a salad and after that I want her to paint. That salad is well deserved, girl. Oh my gosh, she's sweating. I should probably start talking to someone new. I'm actually scared that Jose already has a wife or something because he wasn't really liking us and I don't know if I should force it or maybe I should just go out again and meet someone else she reached level 2 amazing is there someone a potential daddy hello <laughs> it's him again it's Don Lothario again okay you are around us often so let's just get to know each other hello sadie okay she's here hello i heard a lot about you um let's share the news hey woman i'm talking to him are you happy are you sad <laughs> is he crying oh my gosh this is amazing this is amazing you don't even know us hello is okay, I'm out. This is so weird. I don't even know this woman and she's already telling me she's pregnant. Like, I'm not her friend. But that's okay. We will be friends. Don't worry. Stop. 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 
please stop okay no you shouldn't get going please he actually doesn't want anything to do with us but we want to talk to you so stop oh my gosh don't be so rude he turned his back on us look at me i'm sweating i ran after you the least you could do is be nice to me i was scared he's eating our salad but he's actually just cleaning up for us she reached training level 3 good job girl and that actually looks decent all right she finished it let's sell it um let's cook vegetable dumplings i'm so glad that he likes us because <laughs> finding the first baby daddy was difficult we pretty much talked to three guys and only the third one was okay with being flirty with us i understand that Jaden had a wife but i don't know what's um jose's problem she's so sweaty this poor girl like why are you sweating you don't even have babies yet i think i will be traumatized to be honest if i have more than one at a time <laughs> because um after the infant update i tried having kids and i only raised like two infants and it was already too much so i'm afraid okay bye don i will call you after i give birth to my child um but i also wanted her to eat so please eat i also want her to write if you have any suggestions what I should make Sadie do, like do you want me to make her write a book about each daddy <laughs> or do you want me to paint the kids or or if you have any other ideas let me know in the comments. Why are you drinking water from the bathroom? You have a sink in the kitchen too. So it's the next morning and she woke up angry okay <laughs> i don't know why you're slamming your fridge don't talk to sadie right now also everything better be exactly where it's supposed to be and work exactly as it's supposed to the slightest thing out of line will make sadie blow up in a fit of irritation ah the joys of hormones and expecting a child and oh she also feels sick sadie woke up feeling violently ill oh she's going to throw up i'm so sorry I feel so bad, Sadie. And I was thinking then we could go somewhere, like go to the park or something to socialize with people and get to know more potential baby daddies. But we also need to paint because we need the money and we're struggling still. I love this outfit on her. She looks so cute. But now that you're ready, it actually makes me want to stop. It makes me want to go out, so let's travel somewhere. I'm thinking, should I ask Dawn to come? I feel like we could get to know someone else as well, but invite him to hang out with us. Okay, Sadie and Dawn have just arrived to the park. Look at this baby mama. Look at her. She's so stylish. Wow let's say hi i guess you're no why why is no don't insult him oh my gosh stop it you're ruining it for us apologize right now right now i'm so sorry don you know it's the hormones i'm pregnant i'm so sorry okay fine that's okay with me i love this park look at that who is this guy he looks homeless are you okay sir where are you, Sadie? <laughs> Look at her stomping in. Okay, I understand you're angry. Um, why are you standing in the water? I guess she wants to stay in there. I mean, if it makes you feel better, go for it, girl. I will support you. Look at them. Oh, he joined us in the water. <gasps> Is it our baby daddy? Hello? Now, this... It's a bit awkward. Let's just pretend he's not here and continue talking. Tell a dramatic story. 
Why are you still sweating? You're in the shade. But honestly, they are kind of cute. Like, look at them standing in the middle of this pond. Where are you going? Where are okay. To chat, I was scared. She looks like she's going to beat him up. I got scared for a second. <laughs> yeah, show him some more photos. I don't know how to call him our situation ship. Now that Alfred is here, I guess we could share the big news with him. After all, he's the baby daddy, so... Yep, Sadie, come on here. Okay, Sadie. Oh my gosh, you're so sweaty. <laughs> She's so mad. Where... Where is she going? Girl, are you okay? I think you should go inside. The sun is not... Good for you. Wait... He didn't like the news or what is going on? Okay, he's just... She's just telling him? What is going on? I'm so confused. Did she tell him the big news? Or... I, I don't know. Can you go away please now? I didn't... I didn't even have to ask him to go away. Okay, sir. We're done anyway. Um, let's talk to him a bit more and then... Declare love for sun. Don't, you will eat at home. Oh, and also another thing I forgot to tell you guys. Uh, I'm pretty sure she's in her second trimester now. Um, I was thinking about sending her to the gynecologist. And I don't know if you heard about the ultrasound scan mod. But I was thinking we could send her to get an ultrasound scan of each pregnancy. And then we could hang it up on the wall. It would also mean that we would get to know the gender of the babies or baby no don't be mad don't be evil <laughs> we would get to know the gender of the babies earlier but i think that's okay right i mean it's pretty realistic even in real life you would get to know your baby's gender beforehand but if you wouldn't want me to look at the genders i could do that too i would just hang it up and be done but yeah i feel like we could send her Oh, okay, I guess not. Hey, Sadie, I think I have a crush on Jose. Wow. He has a crush on Jose, the guy that we actually wanted to go for. The guy that's a trainer at the gym. Wow. I don't know what to say. It's also kind of weird that we didn't even talk about us with Jaden, and he's already trying to go on a date with Jose. But you know what? Go for it. Just go for it, I guess. Yeah, I was on my way to send her to the gynecologist. No, Alfred is not coming with us. You will go home right after you get your scan. Okay, she's back. And I think we should go home. It's pretty late and she... She seems... Like, she had enough. She also has some back pain now. She's hungry. <laughs> I understand. I understand, Sadie. Oh, no. Bills have been delivered to our mailbox. And we don't have enough money to pay all of them. Aw, Sadie's sad. How can they not be happy? Sadie's partner reacted very poorly to the news of Sadie's pregnancy. Yeah, I don't blame you. And after all that, he asked us, what are you carrying? <laughs> I guess she's eating um, something. What is happening? Okay, whatever. Just do you, girl. Oh no, she's so heartbroken. Like, imagine your baby daddy says he's unhappy with the pregnancy and then he asks you if he should go on a date with the person. That was your potential baby daddy number two. But also, I don't know. It's just so weird. Okay, whatever. You are strong. You don't need no Jaden or however he was called. No, he wasn't Jaden. Was he Alfred? Yes, you don't need him in your life anymore. He did what needed to be done. He got you pregnant and that's what matters. Okay, sell it to the collector. Then paint another painting and then you can go to sleep but i really need you to pay your bills we still have 163 simoleons 
We also forgot to hang up our ultrasound scan. So let's just do that now. I think we can place it here. Look at that. <gasps> She's having twins. Ultrasound examination results. The patient named above is pregnant with twins. It will most likely be one boy and one girl. Look at that. Look at the babies. Why are you sad again? Is it still the same thing? Yep. Look at how pregnant she is. She's so pretty. Why is she still sweaty? Are you okay? Oh my gosh, she looks so sad and stressed out. I feel so bad for you. Yep, eat the food, it's good. Come on. And I was thinking we could ask Don over, but I don't know, it's going so slow with him. Oh, cute outfit choice, Sadie. I love it. She looks so cute. She's like, I'm not gonna let this ruin my mood. I look good no matter what. I love her in this. Don Lotario will be right over. Okay, do a small painting until Don gets here. Okay, he's already here. <laughs> oh, it will be the third trimester in four hours. Can you finish the painting, please? Hello? <laughs> so much negativity. Hello, Sadie, can you please finish the darn painting? Oh, Fred, what do you want? Guess what? My date with Jose Vera went very well. Happy for you. I'm here struggling, being sad because of you. I'm glad you had a good date. Oh my gosh, she's been painting that small painting for hours now. Finally, okay, sell to collector. I want to buy a laptop or something for her to write, but I also need the money. Okay, whatever, buy. It's done, okay, sell it and go use the bathroom. And she's also hungry, so clean out spoiled food. What do you mean spoiled food? Okay, so I guess you have to cook again. Let's cook some grilled cheese. I feel like we could paint some more. I don't feel like she's in the mood to talk to someone anyway. You already painted that, but okay. I think she already painted it like two times, but I guess that's her favorite thing to paint. Okay, so it. Oh, she's going to cry it out. Okay, if that helps you. Aww. Okay, Sadie just woke up because she needs to use the bathroom and it's 5 a.m. Look at us. Her sleep schedule was so bad and now it's so good. It's actually weird. Who wakes up at 5 a.m.? But her boobs are ginormous. Look at her. <laughs> She's going to eat and then I'm thinking we could paint some more so the babies can come every minute now and I hope you're ready girl because your life will change and it will be a struggle more than it is now she's so pretty I can't look at her smiling finally she's not sad anymore she's happy she's ready let's do a painful Painful? Why did I say painful painting? Let's do a playful painting. Let's see. What will it be this time? What is she painting? Is that a train? Whoa. I thought she would paint something better after so much practice, but I guess not. <laughs> Let's just sell it and... How are your needs? We are pretty good. Let's do another one. Let's do a sad painting this time. What is that? I'm so confused. Oh! She reached level 6. Good job. Are you okay? <laughs> that looks creepy. How are you overheating? 
you're inside and you're wearing your pajamas. She's probably just waiting for these babies to come out already. She's so good at drinking water. This is a reminder for you guys. Drink your water, just like Sadie drinks her water. <laughs> she looks so miserable. I wish I could help you, but I can't. We just have to wait for the babies to come out. Sadie's in labor, finally. Oh my gosh, Sadie's bursting. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. What are you doing with the trash? You're... Look at this woman. She's in labor and she's like, Oh, I should empty the trash first. You know, I want my kids to come home to a nice, clean house. Um, okay, I think she, you should have the baby, girl. And she is wearing her heels. Such a diva. Look at her. Gorgeous. Amazing. I love this girl. She's so strong. Okay, have the baby, please. Because what are you doing? Washing her hands. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's enough. Just have the babies already. Congratulations, it's a boy. Now, when it comes to names, I was thinking we should go in alphabetical order. Because I just want to know in what order they were born. And also I want to know which ones are sets of twins. Because I'm scared that by the 100th child, I will forget <laughs> about many of my children. So yes, we have to find a name starting with an A. So let's see. Come on. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. I thought it would be quicker. Okay, this is taking forever. So I'm just going to name him Axel. And for the baby girl, let's see. Will there be a name starting with an A? <laughs> Finally, the first name that popped up was Arya. So... Now we have babies, Axel and Arya. Where are the babies? I want to see the babies. Where are they? Are they upstairs? Yep, they are. Okay, let me move them to their room. Oh, look at them. How cute are they? Hello, baby Arya and Axel. They are so cute. My first twins in this challenge. Where are you? Come check on your kids. No, it's not the time to cry it out. Why are you still sad? You have babies now. Let's talk to them. Let's get to know them. Oh, 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 oh. Alfred is calling. What do you want? It's good to hear your voice, Sadie, I'm sure. I wanted to ask if I should get to know Nefertari Gamal. I thought he would call to check on his kids you know to ask if he could come over or something but no and you know what i don't care um i guess mom is going to cry i feel so bad you should be happy let's cuddle the babies come on and let's cuddle the other baby as well and i feel like with that we can end the first episode of this challenge right here I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had fun on this journey. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.